Can't wait to talk about this horse. Vowen declare he's a Melbourne Cup winner. This is his fourth Melbourne Cup. I actually think the horse is obviously flying. That it's might and stakes uh, finish, obviously, alligator blood. And that forms Frank through a very strong uh, Cox Plate. Um, and then I didn't mind the run in the Mooney Valley Gold Cup either. He was wide for most of the trip. Got pit by Cleveland, who, Tom, you quite like. I don't know. What do you think, Tom? He jumped $7 on Betfair there. Um, last start, he hit 890 in play in the Mooney wow. Valley Cup and um, only went down just three quarters of a length. Um, he drops one and a half kilos from last year's Melbourne Cup when he ran 10th. I think he's going better this year. I think he's Agreed. going really well. Um, carried 52 when he won it. Um, got 53 this year. No horses won the Melbourne Cup two years apart other than um, Peter Pan, um, the Clive Diva. Um, they had a class to do it four years apart. Mm. I can't so. <laughs> even think of that happening in any major race, really. Amazing, yeah. So, um, again, I think he can run 5th to 12th, but um, I don't think he's good enough to win it at the moment. Another horse that's probably going to have to go forward from the gate to get itself into the race and be a winning chance, and it just looks a bit messy. All those horses that I rate 5 to 10 chances, a lot of them have drawn really awkwardly, which mm. makes it hard. It does make it hard, and I think uh, the one thing is he did draw badly uh, when he won the cup. Yep. Um, but that was a that was a Craig Williams Went forward that day. Yeah, yeah no, he did, and yeah. that was a, a a Craig Williams masterclass, and it was. B they they it was very much run to suit. Mm. Um, no, I, I must admit I was willing to pot him after that Martin Power run um, originally. I, I thought a tough run, alligator blood. Uh, you know, they, he he'd drawn them up to them. He was sort of flattered in the way that uh, he'd managed to get in second, but. Look, I mean, Alligator Blood's franked it since. Jewess has franked it since. Um, I think that uh, even Don Knowledge yesterday running fourth uh, in the Empire Rose. I think that uh, you needed to see him take that, not even a step forward, but just to show that he was he was at that form level uh, in, in the Mooney Valley Cup. I think he did. Um, yeah, I think he's going better than, than he ever has. Um, yeah, yes, well. I know he, he, he ran, he had that really good prep in the Turnbull, Caulfield Cup, Melbourne Cup, uh, that year, um, but again, he was down the weights in, in the cups. Um, I really like what he's doing uh, at the moment. Uh, I have to have him uh, somewhere in the mix. Um, he's probably the one I'm including in all the trifectas, all the exacters. Um, yeah, get get Solcom and, and and Vauban on top of him, and I think uh, that's hopefully hopefully a result somewhere there. Well, you're going to get a good price on the Betfair Exchange, and we'll see what happens. Whether maybe he uh, he goes to the lead like he did winning the Melbourne Cup with. Craig Williams and obviously controlling the race from start to finish. Chances are you're about to lose. For free and confidential support, call the number on the screen or visit the website.